This is Dave Rogie. I'm here this afternoon for the Chelan High School Sports Blog, and uh, I'm talking with Luke Gleesman, one of the senior athletes here at high school. And Luke, you had some pretty exciting stuff happen here recently, so why don't you tell us a little bit about what's going on? Uh, well, in, about two weeks ago, I took a visit to uh, Carroll College in Helena. It's an NAIA school, and they... Uh, They've always uh, had some interest in me and have been contacting me. And so then after my visit, I sat down with the head coach, uh, and he was willing to offer me about a $19,000 uh, athletic scholarship. And on top of that, I would also receive a 13000 academic scholarship. So they ended up paying about 80% of my college expenses just based on those two scholarships. Wow, how exciting that must be for you. Tell me a little bit now, you, you mentioned academics, so obviously that's something that you find important. Let's talk about that just a little bit. What kinds of things have you been looking towards as far as setting goals for yourself in your future career? What kinds of things have, are of interest to you? Uh, well, right now I'm planning on going into some field with, with physical therapy or health science somewhere in there. Uh, and so I have taken some classes here that are offered at the high school that have to do with anatomy and just basic body parts, stuff like that. Uh, and I've also kind of just, I push myself to take harder math classes, and so hopefully I can get, get those, like, cheaper credits here in high school and get those out of the way now instead of paying more and having to take them in college. That's a great idea. That I can tell you that I followed the uh, Allied Health Science uh, curriculum myself, and... and the more you can do now, the better off you are, certainly. Um, let's talk a little bit about your sports background. I know you, uh, of course, I've been watching you since you were prior to high school, but since you were a freshman, and, and uh, I know football is a big deal, but let's talk about your sports in general. What kind of things have you been involved in? Well, I've played, for all four years I've played football, basketball, and baseball. Uh, in football and baseball, I've been four, a four year, I'm going to be a four-year letterman in both those sports, and I'll be a three-year letterman in basketball. Uh, I've see, received numerous all league awards in uh, football and baseball, and I've received an all league award this year in basketball. Uh, I was league MVP this year in football. Wonderful. So yeah, it's been quite a few different awards for that. How do those things? How do you feel about all that? Does that mean you know? I mean, obviously, a person's got to feel good about their accomplishments. How do you feel about getting those awards? Well, I'm thankful for that because uh, I did have a big injury, and being able to come back from that injury and receive. Uh, multiple awards after that as well as before that is also is just a big accomplishment personally okay. for me. Great. Let's talk about going on to college now. You've got, uh, tell us, when, when do you have to begin? Uh, at when are they expecting you to report over there? And um, uh, what are you expecting? What kinds of things are you looking for? forward to? Uh, well, in the next couple of weeks, they're going to start sending me off uh, weight programs and uh, their routes because they'd like me to play tight end. And so I'll receive that in the next couple of weeks. And from now until about, I believe, the end of July, I'll be on my own, just working out, trying to prepare myself the best I can uh, on my own. And I'm not quite sure the exact date or whatever, but I'm guessing sometime in August they will uh, would like me to be there and I'll get all moved in and start football practice. Uh, they've talked about me redshirting the first year, but they're not quite sure yet, which mm -hmm. is a probably a good idea, mm -hmm. which is understandable. Mm -hmm. And so I think... Uh, that's where we're pretty much the road's heading to right now. Right now, you're you're about six two, maybe two ten or two fifteen. I'm guessing, so I don't know that for a fact. But um, have they said anything to you about your their expectation about weight gain or muscle gain or anything, or just kind of told you to start getting yourself built up a little bit? Yeah, it's all right now. It's more about just muscle gain and not really quite weight gain because they do like my weight that I'm at right now and uh, and. Uh, and if I'm also just gaining muscle, I'm also just going to get quicker. But if mm -hmm. I'm gaining weight, I also kind of – that's something else I'd have to work just as much at. So I think sure. they're saying that muscle will reflect on my quickness and sure. stuff like that. So it's just all – not really more – it's more about just gaining muscle and quickness and not much as much as mm -hmm. weight. Now, going to a tight end position, I think you played tight end one year here at high school, if I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. um, are you excited about that? Um, has it kind of got you a little anxious? How are you feeling about that? Well, yeah, I'm, uh, I've played – my sophomore year, I was kind of more of a fullback tight end, kind of, I would block a lot, so I'm familiar with it. And like this year, I also had to go play line a little bit and block there, so I'm more, I'm comfortable with that tight end position. Right. And I'm sure your parents and everybody in the family must be pretty happy for you. Oh, yeah. 
they're really excited. Well, well, we are too, and uh, certainly we hope to be able to follow you. We try to get, I try to keep in touch with the kids, so we'll have to be sure to keep make a connection. And of course, you want to get on the window of fame for the truck, so we'll need to get a Carroll College sticker as soon as we can. But uh, uh, hopefully, we'll be able to keep in touch with you, and we want you to keep in touch with us so we can make sure that people know how you're doing. Um, you know, I talk to a lot of guys. I've gotten a chance to watch a lot of you guys grow up over the last few years. And I got to tell you, Luke, I am so excited for you. There's, you're one of those that really has earned and really does deserve uh, this opportunity. You've grown tremendously as a human being, first and foremost. But you're a tremendous little athlete, tremendous good athlete, big athlete. And uh, I personally wish you all the best. And I know that the school and all the community feels the same way. So good luck to you over there, and make sure you keep in touch with us, and we'll be watching baseball here and how that progresses for you as the spring comes on. So good luck, Luke, and uh, take care. Thank you. You bet. Thank you.